What's up, everybody? Welcome to my channel, Romeo Entertainment Global. I just wanted to hop on for a second to say thank you to all the wonderful, loyal Janet Jackson fans who uh, tuned in and watched my series, part one, two, and three of touring with Janet Jackson. All of the comments and the interactions, I absolutely loved them and appreciated them. You guys are the bomb. Man, Janet has the best fans in the world. I also want to say thank you to you guys who um, were just so gracious and kind. Part two, I had audio issues. You can, you can barely hear me. And, um, you know, you guys addressed it, but you were just really sweet and kind. I appreciate it because all this stuff is new to me, so I'm still learning. And uh, the fact that uh, tons of you watched it and commented and, um, you know, some of you just reached out and said, hey, I can't hear you. Uh, be sure to turn the volume up. I just really appreciate how you addressed it. So thank you so much for that. Uh, some of you guys have mentioned or suggested that I should write a book telling some of these stories and talking about the uh, principles that I'm talking about. I haven't really promoted and pushed it in these videos because I just wanted to focus on uh, Janet's tour and it was so much to cover. You saw how long the videos were and it still took three parts. So I didn't really push anything else. I just wanted to talk about that and give you guys as many uh, answers to that as I could. But I do have a book. I have a book and it's called Following the Voice, Sounds Produced from Heaven. It's on Amazon. Get it on Amazon. If you want an autographed copy, you have to go to RomeoJohnson.com and you can get an autographed copy. Uh, again, that's Following the Voice sounds produced from heaven. Uh, this book is um, it's an inspirational autobiography. Yes, I do cover some of the stories that I talked about and a whole bunch more. It's a lot in there basically talking about how God's voice led me through this career from Chattanooga, Tennessee, all the way to touring around the world with people like Janet and Michael. Uh, so if you get a chance, go pick it up, get you a copy. Again, uh, you can get it on Amazon. If you want to get an autographed copy, you have to go to uh, RomeoJohnson.com. Uh, what else do I want to talk about? Also, some of you had asked about a live Zoom. So um, I definitely want to talk to you guys more and, and be able to say hi to you and, and answer more questions if you if you have some. So I'm going to plan a live Zoom on Thursday, January 27th. That's just a couple of days at about five o'clock Pacific Standard Time. Okay, so Thursday, five o'clock Pacific Standard Time. I'm going to do a live Zoom, so you guys feel free to just chime in and let's just talk. Is there anything else I want to talk about? Oh, when you get this Zoom notification, it's probably going to say Romeo Johnson's Sangas Weekly Forum, okay? So, first of all, Sangas, which you see here, Sangas is a, is a company that, uh, that God gave me quite a few years ago. And it's been celebrated within the within the industry with a lot of amazing singers who rock it. And I'm gonna start going a little more mainstream with it. So you get a chance, shoot over to Sangas, S-A-N-G-A-H-Z merch, M-E-R-C-H dot com, and check out the store there. I'm gonna be adding more and more merch to that. I just wanna jump on real quick to say thank you to you guys. I really appreciate it. I'm so looking forward to uh, Janet's documentary, just like I know you guys are. I'm gonna be glued to the TV just like you. A lot of you are asking me, are you gonna be on the documentary? Um, I mean, not being interviewed or anything like that. I'm sure I'll probably be in some of the background scenes or something like that. But I'm excited to, uh, to see it and see what Janet has to say to the world. And um, after the documentary is aired, stay tuned, because of course I'm gonna do a post saying, you know, what I thought about it, how much I loved, what part, which parts I uh, remember, um, things I didn't know. We just, we'll just talk about it again. All right. So thank you again so much. Uh, I know Janet appreciates the loyalty and the love that you guys give to her. Man, it's the bomb. If I was an artist, I would want that type of support. But I want to be an artist, though. <laughs> God bless you guys. I'm in the gym right now at the house. And I'm trying to get it back right. Because I was, I was getting right. And then I started getting wrong. A little bit wrong. But, uh, uh yeah, after all of that, after the documentary and everything is over, then I'm going to do a touring with Michael Jackson. Thank you again so much, you guys, for the viewings. Thank you for the likes and the comments. Thank you so much for the subscribing and sharing. You know, I really appreciate it. That's about it. I'm going to get busy and get some sweat on. Oh, let me introduce you guys to my babies. This is my newest baby. This is baby Corey. That's what I call him, baby Corey. That's the new addition to the family. It's a 2021 Corvette C8. This is the old classic here. 
Let you guys in on some of my see, we, we we fam now, you dig? This is Jackie, Jackie the Jaguar, 1997 classic baby. You know? Uh, you know I, I, I've loved cars since I was like nine years old. Oh, hold on. Um, baby Corey is getting a little attitude because y'all got to see Jackie topless. So baby Corey wants to show off a little bit. <laughs> Yeah, show him what's up, baby, Corey. Ooh, me. Uh-huh. What y'all say? What you say about the red guts? What you say I can hear? Huh? You say something about some red guts? You said something about the red guts, didn't you? That's baby Corey. I got one more. I almost forgot. I got to show y'all Big Rube. I can't leave Big Rube out. That's Big Rube, the Rubicon. Big Rube gotta stay outside, you know, he can handle it, he's rugged. He's built for, for being rugged. I can't put Jackie outside, because Jackie, like, she's a classic. She's a beautiful, old, sweet, classy lady. And, and you know, Corey's a toddler. <laughs> can't put baby Corey outside, but uh, Big Rube can handle it. All right, I'm gonna quit acting silly. Those are my babies. Um, thank you once again. You want to say bye to them, baby Corey? Talk to them.